To keep yourself updated, subscribe to Indigo Learn and click the bell icon and download our app OneFin to start learning on the go. Welcome to Indigo Learn. Today we will take our journey through understanding Microsoft Excel. Now whether you are working in finance or in sales and marketing or in operations, wherever you are working, wherever you interact with numbers, this is one software you would be required to use. Now when I started my articleship, when I was doing my CA, I wish someone would have taught me various functionalities of the Excel so that my journey of learning finance would be easier. I would have been able to work more efficiently. Only after working for three to four years, I realized the importance of Microsoft Excel. Though I knew some basic things, I was not aware of how I could use Excel to save time to do things faster. Now for a lot of us, we think Excel is something where we just need to capture the numbers. It is not that way. As we understand various functions of Excel, as we see various practical applications, you will understand how this software can make your life easier. Before I thought of starting these lectures, I spoke with some students, I spoke with some working professionals, I spoke with some of the interns, I in fact carried out a survey where I asked them some simple questions like, what are the three things that you think you should have known before you started your career? And I got answers which were very basic functionalities of Excel. Some of them came back saying, had we known some if we would have been in a much better position while we started working. Some of them came back saying, we wished we would have known pivot table. And then some people came back saying VLOOKUPS. So these are some basic things that we need to learn before we start our career. And in fact, when I started working, I had very little idea about these formulae. Only after I worked for 10 years, Today I can say, yes, I know some good amount of Excel. I still don't call myself as an advanced professional in Excel, but yes, I know some formulas, some data analytics abilities, some tools, some techniques, which came out of my own learning experience. Apart from whatever I learned by attending some sessions, there is a lot of insight that I got while I started working. And once we master these shortcuts, these tricks, the formulae, the functionalities, our life as a working professional would be much, much simpler. You will not believe you will be able to do your work much faster if you know some basic stuff about Excel. Now, as we start this Excel learning journey, we'll talk about some of the basic stuff, then we'll understand some of the basic formulae, then we'll move on to some advanced formulae with a lot of practical application. See, there is one way to learn that is you by heart all the formulae, but if you are not able to apply them, if you are not able to visualize various scenarios, that learning will not be of any use. So we will run through various live practical examples so that your learning about Excel is perfect. So now let's start our journey and let's understand the various aspects of this beautiful software, Microsoft Excel. Now Excel, when I say it's an application which is provided by Microsoft and which is widely used across the globe. Now, what is this Excel all about? This Excel is nothing but a spreadsheet application. Now, when I say spreadsheet, in your childhood days, if you remember, you would use a particular kind of notebook for your maths, right? Whenever you used to write numbers and all, you had those small squares, basically intersection of rows and columns where you used to write down numbers. Spreadsheet is nothing but a similar kind of a display or a paper where you can see a lot of rows and columns where you can capture data. Now, this is not only about numbers, you can also capture text, you can also capture date, you can also capture time, a lot of things can be done. Now, Microsoft Excel is widely used. Other than these, we also have a lot of free softwares available for spreadsheet like LibreOffice or OpenOffice. All of those are free to use spreadsheet application. We will be focusing our learning on Microsoft Excel because that is one software which is used widely. 